Controls and Variables – How to Conduct a Controlled Experiment Jennifer wants to know which type of fertilizer will produce the most corn. First, she needs to think about all the variables or factors that could affect her experiment. Amount of sun, amount of water, amount of fertilizer, type of fertilizer, and type and size of plant. Only one of these factors should be changed. The factor you change is dependent upon your question. Jennifer wants to know which type of fertilizer will produce the most corn. Her factor she will change will be the type of fertilizer. The one factor that is changed during an experiment is called the independent variable. To determine if the factor you changed made a difference, you need to measure something. What you measure is again determined by the question you are asking. So Jennifer wants to know which type of fertilizer will produce the most corn. Her factor she will measure will be the amount of corn. The factor or variable that you measure is called the dependent variable. All other factors and variables need to be kept the same or constant. Same amount of sun, same type and size of plant, same amount of water, and same amount of fertilizer. These factors or variables are called controls. By changing only one factor and keeping all the rest the same, you can determine if that factor makes a difference. Jennifer will give the corn 8 hours of sunlight each day, 200 milliliters of water every other day, she'll use the same type and brand of corn started from seed, plant it in 500 grams of fertilizer each, and use goat fertilizer, cow fertilizer, and chicken fertilizer. Here's the results after 3 months. With the controlled experiment, you know the difference in the amount of corn is due to the type of fertilizer and not some other factor. Thank you for watching another Adventures in iSTEM and Beyond video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications for more Adventures in iSTEM and Beyond videos. For more ideas on how to incorporate science, technology, and skills for life into your classroom, go to adventuresinistem.com.